and greetings this is Johnny Panzer from Panzer Labs and today I am once again playing Offworld Trading Company the new RTS from Mohawk Games <laughs> yeah exactly <clears throat> so um, this is the second part of the series pardon me <laughs> um, and uh, uh, to check out the first part, you could simply click the link at the bottom of the screen. Or if you would like to, you could read my written review of, review of the game by clicking the other link at the bottom of your screen. It's the one right next to the first link. Or you can simply choose to go into pencilabs.blogspot.com at a time of your choosing and read uh, the review then. Or any of the other reviews and articles I have up on my blog. And right, that's the introduction. Um, this time around I'm not going to make a very lengthy introduction, instead I, I, I think I'm just going to dive right into the game. Uh, and for this second part of the series I will once again for a second time choose to play a single player skirmish game against the AI. However this time I will not change the difficulty setting, uh, instead I will keep the default setting of employee. If you remember the last time I lowered it to assistant. Uh, which led to what I can only refer to as an undeserved win against the AI. I did not play a very good match and yet I managed to claim victory. So let's keep it at employee and hopefully it won't um, it, it won't be a total disaster. With that said, let's just start playing the game right now. Right, so let me just uh, pause the game and I'm going to explain a few things that I never explained the f in the first video. Now, when you start scanning and the, the setup part of the match, the first thing you should do is zoom out all the way and then check for bad terrain. Bad terrain uh, would be things like all well, these places where there's not a lot of room to settle in an HQ. And here you have a canyon. Now, inside the canyons you can there will never be any resources present in canyons and you can't uh, deploy your HQs there so this is basically a useless swat of land so also you would like to go in the opposite direction of any visible resources in particular if you're playing against other players because players have a tendency to go with the visual stimuli and if they see resources here for example most players will start to scan in this direction so it might be an idea to scan in the opposite direction that would give you uh, your own set of land um, also don't be in a rush to uh, settle because settling last or later on might actually give you some bonuses if you see here you can see that the first HQ to settle sure you get the may get the best uh, a spot of land but you will have to wait much longer for the black market to open and the last HQ to settle here will get get one extra claim at HQ level 2 and uh, you only have to wait 60 seconds for the black market to open, open. so that's a uh, that's actually a decent incentive to, to uh, settle later. Uh, but of course if you find a really good spot of land go for it. But with that said I'm just gonna start scanning and uh, I'm gonna go in this Medium direction. Of iron found. Some iron, Low levels of carbon found. more iron and carbon. Let's iron see found. if there's anything interesting in this direction. A geothermal vent. Water and that iron. Medium levels of water lots found. and lots of iron actually not a lot of aluminum so far where is the aluminum is up there uh, Medium levels there we of have iron more found. aluminum any iron scientific colony founded uh, Expansive no colony founded. but there's lots of We're aluminum the there founded. Low levels of silk mm, and found. So actually we might want to go... Is there any... I, if I can only find some carbon High levels around of here. Found. Medium levels uh, of carbon. Carbon, found. yeah. Let's go with a scavenger and let's settle him right there actually. No, right there. Oh, this is a bit difficult, but I'm going to pick 
that spot. Right, now with that said, let's get some aluminum. Uh, where would I want that? Let's get that aluminum spot. Uh, some iron is something I do not need because I am a scavenger and I use um, carbon instead. So let's get the carbon spot. Uh, actually, let's get one more carbon spot, I think. Or perhaps I should claim that water tile. The black market yeah, is let's online. claim the water Scientific tile just colony to expanded. make sure we have it. Uh, that way we can start building up our stockpile of water. Right, so we have the carbon going, and as you can see, the scavenger, um, uh, scavenger HQ will uh, use carbon instead of steel. That's why I didn't need the iron. So I need aluminum, carbon, and glass in order to build my buildings and upgrade my HQ. And I will, I'm gonna buy an extra claim. First thing I do in the black market, since claims are actually one of the options. And with that claim, let's get the let's get the geothermal that's nearby. I'm just gonna click the claim and click the map, uh, click the, click the tile that will grant me the claim, even though I don't have I haven't built anything at it. So right now, I'm just waiting for the aluminum and the carbon to start rolling in. The black aluminum market is online. Is well, it's going it's ahead according to plan. Expanded. I have a nice set of carbon going. I should be able to upgrade pretty soon. Uh, I might sell a little bit of uh, silicon. I don't want to sell the glass because I need that. I could sell a tiny bit of carbon and then I can upgrade. Right, Man, let's do that. And with the upgrade, I should start looking at my power production. And also, I now need to focus on... I should probably get food first. The prices for um, fuel and um, oxygen are still quite low, so I don't think I have to get that early on. Uh, instead, what I should do... I need the money for a geothermal. I can sell all my iron. I don't need that. And really, carbon is the thing holding me back. So let's increase my carbon production. I might as well. And let's see. I might want to claim some of that silicon right away. Let's claim. That silicon and that silicon. Right. Now I have two claims left. I think I'm going to build a food production facility Three, and then thousand, teleportation. Four, oh, actually, I do want seven, teleportation. Seven, that will allow me to save eight, a lot of money thousand. on fuel. 8,000, that's nothing. 10,000, 12, 14. Price is going up at IT. God damn it! 20,000, come on! Don't be a douchebag. Just give it to me. I want it and I can. Yeah, thank you. Uh, it's a steep price, but uh, teleportation, especially in if the fuel prices keep rising, which I think they will. Teleportation will save me a lot of money on fuel. You see, right now my fuel need is zero. So let's just build a food production plant. Boom. There we go. And let's get some glass production up and going. What do I need for glass? I need oxygen and silicon. Right now the price for oxygen is not that bad, so yeah, I'm gonna build a glass facility first, then just basically sell a little bit of aluminum, a little bit of carbon, a little bit, little bit of silicon, and then buy some oxygen. There we go. Now I need a geothermal plant because the price 
of power is going up, 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 up. My debt is 35,000. Let's see what the others have. 12,000 debt, 11,000 debt. Well, my debt is highest at the moment, but uh, I should be fine if I keep building the right things, which I may not have done <laughs> so far. But again, I'm not a very good player, but I have, I do have fun. That's the main thing, right? Um, yeah, I am falling behind, but let's just see where that where this leads us. I can sell a little bit more. Also, my debt should start decreasing now, as soon as I have the geothermal plant up and running. Uh, so, right, now I should be able to decrease my debt. And what do I need? I need some more carbon, I need some glass, but the glass production is up and running. Uh, price, the, wa the price for water is actually kind of nice, so... I'm gonna sell a little bit. I still want the stockpile. That way, I don't have to Your produce more water. Oh, they're already buying my stock. Uh, go right ahead. Um, same with silicon. I can sell a little bit, a little bit of carbon without dropping the Expansive price too far. Expanded. And then I can upgrade. I, I, I think I'm going to get a pleasure dome. Eight thousand. Um, I don't want that plot 10, of land because I don't 000, need the iron. 12, so, do I want the pleasure dome or 14, not? That's the question. 000, yeah, 16, I think so. Let's play some pleasure 000, dome. 18, and I still 20, might hold off 000, on 20, the... 000. What's it called? The electrolysis reactor. Scientific colony expanded. I am using a little bit of fuel now, and that would probably be the. Might have been. I don't know where I used fuel, but it was briefly. Never mind. Glass production is up and running. I st <laughs> This is gonna be costly unless I start. I should actually start producing the some oxygen. I need it for my glass, so. Just a little bit. And um, that should put me on the low down when it comes to water, but I have a decent stockpile built up of water, so I don't think that's going to be a massive problem. However, food is not produced at a good rate, so... EMP, buildings disabled. Yeah, where? It's my carbon, but that doesn't matter. I have a decent stockpile of carbon. You just have to remember not to sell it. Uh, aluminum. I think I'm gonna waste my last uh, claim on the patent office. I do want the patent office. I want it there. Um, oh god, I need some money for the goon squads. Where to? Uh, the patent office first, and then I need to protect my pleasure dome. But with the patent office, I want to, instead of building more power feeds, I would like uh, to decrease my power consumption. So perpetual motion is definitely a patent I would like to look into. And since I have the pleasure dome, I certainly want the virtual reality, which Your will double my boring. income from the pleasure dome. And the Pleasure Dome is, is it's sort of a boring building, but it's its actually... I usually don't use it because it's so boring, but it, it's almost overpowered now in the uh, now Beta 5. Uh, with... Uh, sorry, I'm just gonna make sure I get the money to buy this crap. Um, come on, virtual reality sell some glass. There, virtual reality, it will double the in income from my pleasure dome. And right now, no one else has a pleasure dome. If more than one player builds pleasure domes, the proceeds are split between the pleasure domes. So, have, being the only one who has it is actually, I mean, this is $84 per second right into my account, or deducted from my de debt. Patent, water engine. Units are powered with water. 
No, they can have that. Instead, I have 55 seconds left for virtual reality research. What do I need? I still need... Uh, my carbon production is not that great because I'm using it on... I'm not using that much of it. Uh, I need to increase my carbon production possibly, but most of all I need to increase my... No, actually, carbon production is the first one I should increase. Uh, uh, yeah. Your stock's getting sold. Someone sold my stock. Right, well... That's okay. Fine by me. Uh, I'm just gonna sell a bunch of silicon. Uh, buy new goods board for the Pleasure Dome, because that one is right now decreasing my debt at a very steady rate, so... Also, I don't think I'm going to produce much more water, because um, the price for water is just dropping, and I'm s my debt is still going down even though I lack the water. What I should get, however, is perpetual motion, decrease my uh, power consumption by half. Uh, so, let's sell some aluminum, some fuel, because I'm way in the green on fuel. I can actually sell a little bit of glass. How much do I need? 14,000. Right. Well, um, I can sell a little bit of carbon. 12,000. Come on. Okay. More aluminum. Just give me... There we go. Perpetual motion. That should uh, put me on the green, and then oh, upgrade. Right. Uh, yeah. right. Yeah. So I'm level four, and I should really start looking into buying some stocks now. Uh, if I can get the expanded. debt to disappear, how much do I need? I'm it's gonna take me a while before I reach level five, so I might as well. <coughs> <laughs> that was not me coughing. Oh, look at this pleasure dome right now. Uh, the amount of money I'm making is dependent on the size of the NPC colony. And the size of the NPC colony is dependent on the uh, prices of certain uh, resources. Sort of like, like the, um, what's it called, the life support resources and building resources like aluminum and steel. And right now the prices are not that bad. We call it so it's increasing, but look at this. This is $212 every second just deducted from my debt. And the, once the debt is gone, it's going to be placed directly into my account. Someone tried to sabotage my patent office, which gave me a mutiny. Right, so let's see. Who should we target? Let's target Mr. Stock. And let's... Oh, Iron is a decent one. And... I could. I don't need the iron, but he needs the iron, and that means I want it, <laughs> just to piss him off. Right, so I am currently... well, everything is going sort of well. I'd sell a little bit of glass. Uh, I have to defend the EMP. Where? I have been targeted by EMP. Well, that's not. Oh, right. The, because uh, the building is now mine while it's muted. Uh, I don't care. All I wanted was for him not to have it. Uh, right, so. What? Is there anything more that I could be using? Uh, da -da 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 -da, thinking machines. The black market What's is their online. debt like? 26,000, 27,000. Not a lot of interest, so I don't think I'll get financial instruments. Well, actually, I might just do that in case they start to... No, no, let's not. Instead, I need to build things. Right, so let's build some more water. There we go. And with that said, I should build a little bit more food and a little Scientific more colony oxygen. Expanded. 
where did we have the oxygen? There we had it, so... Right, and now I have one claim left. Well, all these new people I'm gonna upgrade instead. Name yet. And... Do, 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 I should get probably some chemicals going. Uh, I could place that next to the carbon facilities. And right, now I would like to save up for the off-world market. And I could get some electronics going. There. Some more glass, Robotic actually more electronics, me. because those are very well priced. So let's get that started. And that's gonna force me to get some more electrolysis. I need that. 75% bonus. Now I am a prime example of... Uh, uh, this is a hotspot for sabotage. But uh, I'm gonna take my chances. Now I'm gonna save the last claim for the off-world market. And see where that leads me. Or I could simply, since I don't need the patent office anymore, I could simply demolish that. <coughs> Let's pow uh, buy a power surge. Where are you, Mr. Competitor? No, my... Oh, look at this beautiful... It's already frozen, so I'm gonna wait for that to uh, unfreeze, and then I'm gonna hit him hard with a uh, power surge. Uh, but until then, let's see, everything is going well. I need more electronics, carbon and glass. The market is online. Uh, but everything is going sort of well. Power, I could use more power. Uh, let's sell some silicon and invest in, let's see. There we go. Sell even more. Uh, sell all that iron that I stole and buy some more. Now my stock price is more or less untouchable for the others. Uh, right, now let's use this on him. He just unfroze. So, boom, let's free some more of that. Yep. That was a lot of fun. Ha ha. And with that said, I still can't buy the off-world market, but I sure would like to. Uh, I'm gonna increase my chemical production. Yes, I am. Uh, where was I'm it? not there. sure how you can buy a magnetic Sabotage storm. Sabotage auction. auction. Magnetic storm. Oh, now. that's a nice one. Destroys Thousand. all the ships in an area. Thousand. Eight thousand. That's nothing. Thousand. Twelve thousand. Fourteen thousand. Now I'm gonna thousand, Jesus. Eighteen twenty thousand. Okay, you know what? You wanna go that much in debt. Uh knock yourself out. Actually their debt is in eight thousand. Uh, should I get the financial instruments? I might as well. So and two hundred and thirty eight dollars for my pleasure dome. That is looking very nice. Right, I could get a new claim for 50,000, but that's a lot of money. I don't think I want to do that, actually. I'm gonna drop the market on silicon, because it might be better on the off-world market. Could have been a bad idea, but... Uh, let's see, off-world market, 67,000. I still lack a lot of carbon. Uh, So, yeah, and Jesus, what happened to my power mutiny? Oh, you bastards, I'm gonna, as soon as that's taken care of, I'm gonna, God damn it! Oh, I hate you people so much, look at that, everything just frozen solid. Oh, you bastards, oh, well. I only have myself to blame. I mean, this is it's such a nice spot for an EMP. But, yeah. Damn it.
The black market is online. Damn it, damn it. Expansive well, colony expanded. Oh, I should really start getting some more stock. Uh, World market. I need 100 plasma trunks, so I could sell some of these, buy some more of this research. Damn it, this is so annoying, but at least I'll start getting money from their death. And yeah, Miss, Mrs. Research is really going heavy on the debt. Her debt is. Well, it's slowly decreasing, but it's at 70,000, and this late in the game, that's not a good thing. But I'm not gonna make a lot of money on her, uh, on her debt. Uh, that's just not gonna happen. Instead, I'm going to... Right, I'm going to defend this little sucker, because that's what put me in the red. And... Uh, what I would like to do is to... I really need a little bit more money. There we go. Claim auction. I could actually be prepared to pay a lot of money for this. Yeah, 20,000. No, I'm gonna have it. I'm going to get that claim because the black market will... I have to pay 50,000 for the claim. 40,000. Yes, thank you. Oh, come on! Yeah, you take it. Right, because now you have a debt. Screw you, asshole. Right, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to tear down the patent office and build an off-world market. And as you can see, the goon squad is saved. The goon squad is tied to the tile, not the building. So I don't have to pay for a new goon squad. And I'm so glad I bought the Pleasure Dome. Without that, I would be in a lot more debt right now. I don't want to sell too much now, because I don't know the prices of the black market yet. It could be beneficial for certain things, so... Let's just power surge. What building was... The water? Oh, well, boo-hoo. Um... Fine, do that. Uh, where's Mr. Production? Right, well, Mr. Production, I would need to... Hmm. Where are you? Where do you have everything that you absolutely need? Uh, the pulse... Uh, let's just get a... Actually, let's get a mutiny and take his power, because the power price was pretty good there. It's going down now, but I might get some money. Right! Off-world market, what is best? 45k... Uh, yeah. Might do that. And no, the electronics are better sold here. But let's ship that out. 45k. Is there anything else that's really good? Yeah. The black market is oxygen online. is actually pretty decent. And then I can simply sell some electronics, buy some of my own stock, buy more of that. What do I need? I need 323k. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This, uh, what's the price of silicon? Silicon is actually better sold right now. There we go. So, off-world market. Uh, I don't want to sell chemicals, I don't want to sell oxygen, but I have a deficiency of oxygen. Off -world shipment launched. So, Look at what all I could the do is tear down one of my hydroponic farms and instead build an electrolysis reactor. There we go. Uh, 38k for fuel. Yeah, I might launch one of those. And then sell some glass. Uh, let's see, silicon is certainly something I can sell. I need roughly 350k. That's doable. Mm. Yeah. 
Okay, I could sell another batch of chemicals. Off-world shipment launched. Uh, and Look another batch of fuel. That should put me in the green for a while. Oxygen is going up. Uh, what else was good right now? What I could do is... Um, 70k. Is it worth it to... No, I don't think it is worth it. I'm going to keep selling this. We caught the dirty rat trying to break our stuff. Yeah, off world market, how is it going? It's going decently. 495, 365. Uh, oh, let's just try to sell everything, and that should give Look me enough for this research. Yes. And with that said, I now have the ability to increase my production, electronics production. Let's just increase that, because it's even better than the off-world market. Let's increase it twice. And increase water. Actually, let's put that on the do down low. And I think it was oxygen, but that was decent. Yes, oxygen might start producing that. Right. So, 97,000. Oh, look at the... I'm just gonna start. Where did they freeze it? It is probably 78 seconds. Yeah, this is the one they froze. So, I'm gonna protect that in case they do it again. And they tried to sabotage my off-world market. That gave me a slowdown strike. Mm -hmm. Let's look at Mr. Production. Where are you? This is not Let's an use the yet. slowdown strike oh, no. on his off-world market. Legal high Adrenaline boost. Mm. Oh, yeah, I want that. That's a really nice one. It will double the production of a certain area. So, 20,000. Oh, come on. 24, 28. 28, that's too much. Oh, 32,000. Yeah, really. Have a lot of fun. I'm not sending anything currently. That's bad. Let's send some oxygen. And then let's send some chemicals. And let's manually sell a bunch of silicon. And there we go. Chemicals are off. I should. Actually, I don't need to increase water production, that's just stupid. Let's increase chemical production instead, all the way, because the chemicals are the ones used to uh, unlock uh, the... Uh, what's it called? The engineering lab research. You use chemicals, so... Right, there we go, and oxygen is sent. I will soon have enough to send some more. Look at all the money. Uh, I should start sending, selling some electronics and some silicon. Oh, then I should start the buying the stuff. Look at all the money. Uh, let's see, 322k. Yeah. Oh, let's sell all the silicon because the price is going down. Let's sell, sell some steel. Oh, off-world market. Come on, off-world market. Where are you? Where I need more fuel. Do I have two now? Yes, I do. I have two. That's why it's sending everything so quickly. Right, so what else is good? I could send some aluminum. It sells for a lot more than... No, let's not do that. Let's sell the fuel. Right, and with that said, some silicon. I uh, could sell a little bit of chemicals. Chemicals are also good for sending on the off-world market. I could buy some of my stock. Uh, I could certainly sell a lot of electronics. And some carbon. And then we can buy out Mrs. Stock. I pretty much have this now. Oh, I could start to... Now I got the hacker array. So let's increase the price for electronics. 
Uh, and glass. And right, I have a surplus of power, which is good. I can unlock uh, yet another shortage of that to increase the price, giving me more money. Off world, off world, off world 47. Uh, even though it costs a little bit to launch it, that should still be. Yeah, that should be better. Right, and some chemicals. How is the production increase going on chemicals? It's going decently well. Your stock is being bought. Oh, someone is buying my stock. That's. I don't know, bad maybe? Sell some. I could sell pretty much everything. And there we go. Yeah, I win. Congratulations, Johnny Panzer wins. Um, uh, right, that's it. I think I did a little bit better this time. Uh, this win did feel slightly more deserved, but still, it's against the AI. It's not that difficult, but it's it's uh, the AI is is still it's pretty decent. It's not a complete walkover. Uh, I did some mistakes, sure, but. Uh, <laughs> Overall, I'm sort of happy with the result. But there you have it. That's the robotics. Uh, I've now shown you the expansionist HQ and the robotics HQ. And let's just hit continue and watch the stat screen. So this one was a lot tighter than I remember the first video. I just took off somewhere along the middle. Uh, let's see if there's anything interesting. Sabotage targeting is always nice to see. Let's see, Mrs. Research. Oh, yeah, she targeted me. Mrs. Production targeted Mrs. Research mostly, and Mrs. Stock didn't really use a lot of black market. Uh, patents. Uh, five in total for Mrs. Stock. Let's see, I had four in total. Virtual reality, perpetual motion, teleportation, and financial instruments. Uh, I don't think I made a lot of money from financial instruments, but maybe. Uh, I wish I could tell that from the stat screen. I would really like to know exactly how much money I made on their the interest of their debt, but I don't know. Well, that's it. Uh, that's the second video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you didn't, or if you did, please leave a comment. And in particular, if you liked it, please subscribe to my channel or like the video. Uh, I will try to produce more videos whenever I have the time. And until then, this is Johnny Panzer signing out.